Good morning, everyone. Swiftgal. We are playing some more Astalong Tears of the Earth. And we are doing some backtracking this session. Uh, namely, I'm hoping... that we can find a few of these doors that we need to... that we didn't have keys for previously that we can exp Um... So we want to head up... Looks like two up and then across to the right. So last time we beat the third Gorgon, we are definitely into, it seems like we're probably getting into endgame. I don't know for sure, um, but we've got two sections. This isn't right. Actually, we never figured out what to do there either. But yeah, we're missing a couple major items, it seems like. Uh, something that will allow us to put out fires. And something that will allow us to break boxes. But, we did find several blue keys, so my hope is that with these blue keys we can now... Wait a minute. Is that it? Yeah, that looks like it. That makes sense. Ow. <laughs> Assuming that this is going to open those locks up, but I don't know that for sure. Whoa! Okay, wait, inspect? I knew it! Poison is coming from the tower. Oh, hey! Huh. Okay. Well, that's really unfortunate. <laughs> I kind of saw that coming, but that's really unfortunate. Um... Let's do another health up. Unfortunately, that does mean that we need to get back to that point. 
which was over here. But we've got those, uh, we have an idea of where we're going now. And we're starting with full health this time, unlike last time. I forgot that that was an attack boost, otherwise I wouldn't have used her. At this point, I'm mostly using Algus for that. Okay, well, we got some bonuses. I'm okay with getting some bonuses, even if it's not specifically what we were looking for. Okay, so that was one of the big ones that we were looking for. Uh, there's something to the left here. Have we seriously not been up here? This looks very straightforward. How have we not been up here? Very grumpy with myself for missing this section. Because I'm like, this actually feels like you can access it without the like super jump or anything, the Griffin Claw. So this is probably a pretty... Okay, that makes me feel a little better. Because that just me or er, it just loops up. Okay. I saw how close I was and figured I would uh, loop around this way instead of going the other way.
Whoa. And we're in a cutscene, apparently. Getting wrecked. That is kind of stupid. <laughs> Not well thought out. So, just to be clear what happened there, uh, as soon as I got to the door, it locked me in place. So I lost control, and despite that, the thing was still able to hit me. Looks like I might be... I don't know, maybe some sort of dark hell for a vampire? Let's see what it says. Wow. Huh. what to make of this area currently. Missing a lot of stuff along the way here. I guess we can just kind of loop around here. I didn't notice that guy. Coming up behind me. Oh. Well, that was a good choice, at least. And there's something there. So that's a good sign. That actually tells us kind of what we need to do. Because that means we don't need to go up there yet. So I'm guessing we need to go probably right here first. But we probably also need to go back before we go too far. That just took us back to the entrance. Okay. So that's kind of the way to make sure you don't get stuck down there, it seems like. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, looks like that requires the whatever the power is that we're missing. That lets you break boxes. Hopefully that's not required to get this, but it looks like it might be, actually. Which is very disappointing. Um... No. Is it? No, there's still a screen to the right that we can go through. Okay. I'm seeing something wrong. That's the room that we couldn't get to the top of the top. That's why. Well, I guess we're stuck on this section for now. We need that power that lets us go through. Which, honestly... gonna say it, which I'm probably gonna die here anyway. Um, so we're missing something, clearly. Um, I honestly don't know where it is. We've got one section left to go through, so that must be where it is. Uh, which is the serpent path. Um, because we've gone through all of this now. This is the only area that we haven't done in the center here. And that one requires being able to put out fires. This one requires being able to go through crates. Um, this is just a jail cell. I can't imagine this being relevant here. So I guess the other option, which I wasn't thinking about, is we do have access to all these green doors now. So maybe we want to do a little bit of that backtracking down here before we go up to the server. Let's go down here. Yeah. That's right here. Get our Beast Hunter orbs for killing some new monsters. Who, or how the uh, attack up works this time. Um. So I guess, I mean, everything else is pretty much in this one section, I believe. Those are the two doors I skipped that I feel like are okay to skip. I guess there's this blue one that I don't remember as well. So yeah, there's a bunch of green doors and a blue door. I think that'll be what we do next time. So let's head back up to mechanism two. And this is where we will pick up next time. Hopefully you are still enjoying. If you are, please give me a like and subscribe. Check out the other content on my channel. 
If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments. And as always, have a good one. We'll catch you next time.